The village of Ravenhurst lies shrouded in mist and dread. Its inhabitants whisper tales of the hag's unholy presence that lingered like a stain on the very fabric of reality. They called her Mistress of Decay, a moniker that seemed fitting, given the withered crone's gaunt form and long fingers that appeared to be grasping for life itself. As the villagers huddled around their fires, they would whisper stories of those who had dared to venture into the fog-shrouded woods beyond Ravenhurst. Few returned, but those who did spoke in hushed tones of the hag's unholy powers, of how she could manipulate the environment and prey on the deepest fear of her victims. One dark, foreboding night, a group of brave adventurers decided to test the legend. They had heard tales of a hidden temple deep within the woods, where ancient artifacts lie waiting for those bold enough to claim them. Little did they know that the hag watched from the shadows, her malevolent force stirring with anticipation. As the party ventured deeper into the woods, the mist grew thicker and the air grew heavy with an unsettling aura of decay and corruption. The trees seemed to twist and wreathe their branches, grasping like skeleton fingers. The ground beneath their feet felt spongy, as if it were alive and fading off their fear. Suddenly, a faint whisper echoed through the fog. Welcome, mortals. I've been waiting. The adventurers spun around, but saw nothing but the swirling mist. It was then that they noticed the air seemed to grow colder, the shadows deepening into the dark, grasping tendrils. The hag emerged from the mist her face, a death's mask of skin and bone, eyes glowing with an otherworldly light. Her presence seemed to draw the very life force out of the environment, leaving behind a trail of desiccated leaves and brittle twigs. You should have not come here, she croaked, her voice like dry leaves rustling in an autumn breeze. Now you will join the countless souls within my realm. The adventurers tried to flee, but the hag's powers were too great. She summoned dark tendrils of energy that ensnared them, drawing them closer as she clackled with glee. One by one, they fell prey to her malevolent force, their deepest fears and darkest terrors brought to life as the hag manipulated the environment around them. The temple they sought became a twisted maze of horrors, its ancient artifacts now instruments of torture. The last survivor, a young woman named Alara, found herself face to face with the hag. Her eyes locked onto those of the crone, and she felt an icy grip on her very soul. You are mine, the hag hissed, her breath like a winter breeze. Alara screamed as the hag's power surged forth, dragging her into the depths of Ravenhurst's darkest recesses. The villagers found her days later, her eyes frozen in terror, her mind shattered by the horrors that she endured. The legend of the hag lived on, a cautionary tale told to frighten children into behaving, but deep within the woods. The crone remained waiting for the next group of brave adventurers to stumble into her realm and to succumb to her internal grasp. To whoever this video reaches, I hope you're having a fantastic day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next. Good night, guys.